All people should know that too many voices muddy the message. That is why there is one Lord above all. And so there must be one yeah, what if he's stupid? the rest. There are two capable men for the role. What if they're stupid? They both want the job. Like, I think I'm pretty stupid, so... Very highly of the other. I think... I, decide between them? I think he's pretty Talk stupid, so... I mean. Solicit the opinion of people close to you. Here. The Bracer of the Sentinel. The Badge of Office. Tonight is your first small council meeting. It would be wise to bestow this Bracer upon your chosen Sentinel then, to show that you are decisive and in control of this house. Wouldn't I be r even Your more decisive if I did it sooner? To see. I understand. I'll do it now. No, he said to do it then. Come speak with me Not when now. you're ready to convene the small council, my lord. In all fairness, you c you it's funny, you can actually give uh, one of those two um the bracer now and then later you can just make you can just change your decision. <laughs> it's like <laughs> I don't know if they note that, but if the characters actually note that, but it's it's kind of funny to think about. Uh, all right. Let's look at the shield for no reason. Ooh, look at that nice shield. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We saw this before. Yep, yep. Cool. Hey, Ryan, how's it going? Careful. Keep at it, and you won't have much left. Something to pick your teeth with. No, Ethan. Look at this. All good swords have a name. I call mine two brothers. I carved this to give me strength. And this, so I remember. I mean, I could never forget, but... And what of your brother Asher? Where's his name? There's only two sides to a blade. Besides, he left, so... Fuck him. <laughs> yeah. Wow, stellar. Someday, I'll have a real one. You're a master like swordsman. Only a lord could have that sword. You'll have a good sword. I'm sure of it. I watched you today. Yeah, I definitely not that. that definitely not that one. That one's fucking garbage. Was he our enemy? I didn't do anything to him. Man. That was the point. Everyone keeps talking about them. Yeah, he was our enemy, but I just decided to not no, fucking he's not do our anything. Enemy, but he did a bad thing. Then I wish you'd hurt him. People who oh do gosh. bad things need to be punished. Someone did something bad to Father and Roger. Someone should hurt them even worse. I want a real sword. Oh, Jesus, could you turn rather violent? Wood. I'll find the men who took Roderick someday, and I'll make sure I have a real sword when I do. Jeez, he turned rather violent there, and Ethan's just like, shit, I don't know what to say. <laughs> it's like, fuck, kid, you got problems. <laughs> oh, fuck. Let's look at the food. Or I can just start, go start talking to this guy. Low, cool. I made the count again. Just to be sure. That's it's totally what I fucking uh, bad, said to do. How long could we hold the house? We couldn't withstand the siege, my lord. If the Boltons or the White Hills cut us off and wait us out, we'd only last a fortnight. But there What's are that mean? steps we can take. In the past, we've demanded food from the small folk to replenish our stores. We can do it again, if you'd like. We've done it before in desperate times. The last long winter, my family had to give all our pigs to the house. No, there must be something else we can do. Well, I hope we find it soon. We won't have much room to maneuver. Oh, it's not a lot of options. Of holding fast. Damn, you're my fucking strategist? Jesus. Trappers. Perhaps they can do more. My lord. Alright, cool. Mmm, so... Alright, so we can, like, fucking talk to all these people. I just don't know if I want to bother. Because I've done all this already. Hey, what's going? Swing left. Sorry. Wrong. I didn't know dogs and old swords. Of course, my lord. One moment. <laughs> Got that thrilling fucking uh, suspense there. What will he say next? Okay, back. Just took a massive dump. Anyway. I have many decisions to make, and I wanted your advice. Um. What's the state of our defenses? Are these men ready for what's coming? This lot, ready? No, 
Where's Adrian? Oh, that's comforting. We post anyone who can hold us along the parapet, up where they won't get much scrutiny, and put our meanest, nastiest-looking brutes front and center. That'll show Ramsey we're a force in our own right. You've got to project power, especially when you're. Wait, so you're, you're just gonna put a spear you, up there? You're just gonna look up there, bring. Oh, then, oh you, no, man. that fucking spear and, uh, is I'll sitting sure there to watch out on top of their fucking desert. fort. After today, I man, that's t intimidating. To Do it like you mean it. Mm. I really don't think Ramsey gives a shit either, but let's talk to Mal. Talk to. Let's talk to Malcolm. Okay, cool. Next game. Ethan. Or should I say Lord Ethan? Hello, Uncle Malcolm. I saw what you did today. Hello there. It's not an easy thing to do. Showing mercy to a man who admits his guilt. But no, it's pretty you'll easy. Excuse me, my lord. I should finish packing before nightfall. I hope to be off tomorrow. At first light. But where are you going? Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother. So you're keeping it from me, but you're gonna tell me that you're packing and stuff. You should just not said that, unless you really wanted me to know. Because she fears you will not agree. I told her my place is here, but I'll be of no help to you in Essos. But she insisted. I will hold, of course, until you've spoken with her about this. Just try to be kind to her. She's been living a nightmare made real. But you know that just as well. She's my mother. I know how to speak to her. I'm yeah. sure you do. But my mother right. scares not the only ones I face. My people are scared as well. I'm told I must choose a sentinel. If no, my choices suck. So bold, Sir Royland is the man for the job. Oh, really? A fine choice. And I trust him. Why Sir Royland? We are at war. You need a warrior by your side. Royland has the respect of his men and will bring strength and discipline to this house. Duncan would offer sage advice, but now is not the time to negotiate. Not with the likes of Ramsay Snow. Thank you, Uncle. Ethan, I need to talk to you. Yeah, Ramsay's, Ramsay's not a very negotiable person, but... Well, I mean, that's actually not necessarily so true, but... Mother he doesn't me much care. Mira has asked for Lady Marjorie's help. Did she? I knew we could rely on Mira. <laughs> I'm so surprised. Seems a family above all else. Hopefully, Lady Marjorie. I thought she was just gonna say enough. fuck off. But right now, I'm more concerned about you. I saw what you did to that man. I, d I, I didn't do anything. That's the point. Everyone knows what happened with Lord Whitehill. Garrett being sent to the wall without my knowledge. I know, and that wasn't your fault. Well, I'm the Lord. It's my responsibility. The people want me to lead. They need me to, but... What? Oh, I get to decide. Please. Tell me. I... I wish Father were here. We all do, but... Father is gone. You dead. are the lord of this house, which is why you must be strong. Just dead. Just say dead. just as capable as Asher or Roderick ever were. I know it. You know it. I only wish you did too. You've always given me good advice. Thank you. Basically, just be strong. Pretty basic, but... <sighs> I suppose helpful. Let's go. Let's just move on. Let's get this fucking shindig out of the way. God fucking damn it. Enough of this horse shit. Maester. Not gonna bother staring yes, at people. No Are you reason. prepared to name your sentinel? Don't feel like being like that right now. Uh, what is your perspective? I don't care. Yes, yes I am. Master. I'm ready. Very well. I will convene the small council at once. <laughs> Duncan, you can clearly tell you must be fucking just peripherally eyeballing the situation there. It's a sort of small house. I mean, I, I, I never noticed that top part before, I don't think. Or, I don't know. But, I isn't it over the wall? Did I mention this in the last part? I don't know. But it's, like, over the wall. And, like, if you had, like, a really good, um, archer, they could probably fucking hit you. I don't know. It's just a bit precarious, that balcony. You may sit. I believe Lord Ethan has reached his decision. Before you I believe, name my sentinel, wrong. I must tell you. 
Uh, it was pretty obvious who sucked here. <laughs> Duncan, Royland, this house needs you both. But you can only choose one, my lord. Let him be yeah, on. Shut up! I'm fucking trying to do my thing. Fucker. Many thought either of you would make a fine sentinel, but I have made my decision. So last time um, I did this, when I first played this through, um, not in the, the recording, uh, in the recording I did, I did the same thing I'm going to do now, but when I first played this, um, I, uh, when I first played it's like blind, not recorded, I, uh, I picked him because I figured like he would be a good sort of opposing opinion for me. Because it'd be kind of like, it's sort of pointless to just pick someone who I'm going to always agree with, or most likely agree with. Um, so I decided I'd mix things up a bit and pick this guy instead. Um, but, because I did that already, Duncan, I Tuttle, think this time I'm just going to go You will him. be my sentinel. Tuttle, this, this is reckless. Lord Ethan <laughs> has made his choice. It's only reckless because you fucking, I will not disappoint you didn't get you, it, Lord. bitch. Now, Sentinel, what do you have to report of Ramdi Snow? Our scouts say he's only a day's ride from here. We've no time to waste. Who knows what he's capable of? We need to prepare for the worst. We can handle Ramsey Snow. He doesn't scare me. The Boltons need our people to harvest the ironwood. Even the bastard Ramsey must understand that. He's not coming here to negotiate. Oh, that was offensive. Don't do that. Don't say that. That's bloody suicide. You call him a bastard. You gamble with the lives of everyone within these walls. Ignore Sir Royland. You named me Sentinel. That's very hurtful, man. Happen. Don't do that. He cannot be trusted. This is the bloody small council. Enough! Would my father have stood for this kind of bickering? I'm not going to pick sides. Neither will I. Sir Royland is clearly able and ready to take up arms, but the rest of our soldiers are not. We need to take a cunning approach. Diplomacy can be a sharper instrument than a sword. The Bolton sigil is a flayed man. Force is the only thing they understand. Gentlemen, please. Thank the gods Mira has asked Lady Marjorie for her help. It's not too late for the Crown to intervene on our behalf. But we must have a plan if Mira's efforts are not successful. I trust Mira's judgment. Which I don't doubt she probably won't be within her power to help us. Mother, what do you recommend we do? We must give him whatever he wants and be done with it. It's too dangerous to do otherwise. Why not make an offering for peace, my lord? Yeah, the wisdom of the citadel. We can give the Boltons ironwood in exchange for their protection. You must be mad. It's pure folly to just give away the only currency we have to yeah, buy. Yeah, all of our ironwood? Like, really? It's kind of suicide. Um, right. We're gonna do My diplomacy. new sentinel favors a certain approach, and I agree. I shall use diplomacy with Lord Snow. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. <laughs> fight without negotiating uh... first. I'll offer our allegiance and try to reach a reasonable agreement. If you aren't ready for a fight, you're bound to lose when one breaks out. I'll be Ethan ready for it. Ethan has made his opinion known, and you will respect his decision. The fucking station guys around, right? Forgive us, my lord. We are, of course, here to serve you, as we served your father. Aye. Well then, let's decide how we shall set the stage for Ramsay's arrival. Invite him into this hall, and meet him face to face. Lord to Lord. Ramsay Snow is no Lord. That's absurd. You meet him at the gate with as much force as we can muster. Make him wait. Let him gaze upon Iron Wrath. And when he enters, he'll know it's only because you allowed it. Lord Ethan? I don't think he must gives a shit, but I yeah, I will. Meet him at the gate. Very good, my lord. Be a little bitch. I shall prepare the men. Men? We hardly have any. It's a foolish plan. How many years have I'm not I gonna kill him. I'm just gonna fucking. I cannot listen to that bloody idiot anymore. To scare him. <laughs> Forgive me, my lord, but you are not ready to be lord. Oh, I I was agreeing with you, You're dick. To get us all killed. Not another word. 
Your father would not approve. God. My lord. Freaking idiot. Apologies. Oh, should I, told, I should have told him to I sit down. That's what I usually do. But now that it is he kind of stormed off that time. I usually, I think, usually he just sits down like a bitch. You will meet Ramsay Snow at the gate, and He's we will distracted not there offer though. our Ironwood. And don't worry, Lord Ethan. I will stand beside you, where your sentinel belongs. Then perhaps we should adjourn. We have to prepare the house. My All right, Lord, cool. You have named your oh, sentinel, great, you're still but here. you still Fuck. seem conflicted. And no matter what, you can't be indecisive. Not if you want to help this house. Well, it seems pretty Forgive decisive, me. wasn't I? I think I was rather decisive. There will always be those who question your leadership, which is why you need allies you can rely on. Family. Mira has done everything she can in King's Landing, but there are others who can help us. What about your brother, like? Asher? Malcolm told me you want to bring him back. He's a skilled fighter. But what's more, he has the will to fight, a hunger for it. He always protected you and your sister, and we need all the help we can oh, get. You exiled him. Why fuck. would you bring him back after you exiled him? He exiled himself. He has no desire to. No, you didn't. That's just, you're just phrasing it like that, aren't you? Asher is you volatile, silly. but that is his strength too. Do you remember the Miller's boy? How he tormented you. I wanted to intervene, but your father said Ethan must fight his own battles. But when Asher saw it, he didn't take a breath. He grabbed the Miller's boy by the neck. That was his first instinct. Dang. Asher knocked out half the poor boy's teeth. Oh shit. <laughs> of course, you're a bit much. Serious, <laughs> but you were in danger, and there was nothing else Asher needed to know. Asher does not hesitate, he acts, and we need that. You have many well, perhaps qualities. a bit too brazen. But you do not have that anger inside you. Asher is dangerous and unpredictable. His presence We don't want him just charging at like Having twelve guys getting shot in the head with an arrow. Helps, especially yeah. now. <laughs> well, look, when we actually see Asher, I'm trying well. to do what's best for this family. What this family needs. Ethan, let me send Malcolm to Essos. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Fine. Bye bye. Malcolm will go to Even Essos if I even if I Asher. tell him to stay here, you'll probably just fucking send him anyway, so Thank I mean I don't I don't actually know that. I'm, I'm not glad sure, you will let me do this. Know that you never stand alone. You are a forester. Mira stands with Unless us. Unless all the other forces are dead. To help us then I stand alone. <sighs> Brilliant. Red Keep, King's Landing. Oh shit. Um. Right. So we'll just kind of we'll just take this shit, I guess. Hmm. Yeah. I did this before, so I'll do it again. I'll just play it the way I did, basically. I don't want to deviate. Oh, I want to stay true to what I did. Fuck. Even though I'm, uh... Marjorie? Not sure it's gonna matter. Oh. Lady Marjorie is still with the king. I thought you'd want to know. Wow, that timing, Thank by the you. way. I wonder how many times she's going to pop in at just look, the right moment. The other day when you asked Lady Marjorie for help, I only spoke out of fear for her. I want to help you. She's giving the dirty look like you bitch. Your poor family. I can't imagine how you must feel. You're sweet to offer, Sarah. Thank you. Lady Marjorie is always saying how important Marjorie. friends and allies are in King's Landing. Marjorie, Just know Marjorie. I will be here for you if you ever need. Wow, god damn, people, stop interrupting everything we do. Mm. 
My lady, I'll leave you to talk. Oh, now you want to leave. Okay. Last time it wasn't too personal. Now it is. How's Joffrey? How's How Joffrey doing? is King Joffrey, my lady? Do you have a good day? Did you get some McDonald's? The king was not inclined to offer oh. help for your family. Whoa, Only what a fucking ended. surprise. Gods. It doesn't really make sense to me based on how I understand the he show. Said it's I was like too easily swayed. And he reminded me that I am not yet his wife. I don't think there's ever a time in the show where he really fear. contradicts no. Marjorie. But it will be a long time before I can ask him for anything again. At least not much. Nothing I said could cheer him. He wouldn't even speak to me when I left him. But my family, they're still in danger. Your family isn't the only thing in jeopardy, Mira. My little brother is only seven years old. I'm afraid for him. For all of them. Ramsay Snow is on his way to Ironrath. And he's pretty mean. This is simply not how things are done, Mira. Not in King's Landing. I'm sorry, my lady. <sighs> yeah, they're pretty stupid here. Queen, and maybe then I'll be in a better position to help you. But for now, now we must both be cautious. I must Wait, you mean them. they I don't take charge in King's Landing? Isn't this like the king's me, place? Wouldn't he have say over everything overall? You know, it's really weird. They never actually, like, when you watch the show, there doesn't seem to be any indication that uh, the crown really knows or gives Making much of a shit about what's going on in the north. I hope oh. that didn't frighten you. I'm glad to see you. Thank you, my lady. I hope you saw. I was right before about Lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. Like even later on. I just want you to know. I can help you if you'd like, and your family, if you're willing to trust me. I hear all sorts of things, things that could be useful for you. How can you help me? My problems can't be solved by what you might overhear. Which is why you must trust me, milady. You need allies. Trust you to do what, to though? To you. I'm sorry. I, I really must go. Please don't despair. I know. They can't just like. Trust you, and then we just wave a magic wand around, and everything's cool. They wouldn't be willing to help you. Like, oh, god damn it! It's always convenient. They always leave at the most inconvenient times. God fucking damn it! What are you looking at? Why? Why does that guy keep fucking staring at me? Jesus Christ! Leave me alone. It's the same dude every fucking time. It's like, no, I'm not gonna suck your dick. I'm already fucking sucking Marjorie, so... Where's Sir Roiland? The man values pride more than honor. And without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us. But I'm confident we've enough strength of our own. Young Wait, we already know she failed? That was pretty fast. Our plan is a good one. It will work so long as everyone does their part. Bolton men approaching, my lord! How come we didn't see them, like, at all? I, I was paying attention to that fucking distance there. And I did not s see any kind of, like, marching band coming by. Something wrong oh, not with even your horses? Gate. Oh yeah, it's closed. It's not there's nothing wrong with it, it's just closed. Well, aren't you the little lord? No wonder you can't open the gate. Shall we help you? Sure, give it a try. <laughs> I'll see you guys break your fucking fingers. This is um, a lovely pile of timber, isn't it? Why the hurry? Are you cold? <laughs> you know I am a bit. Oh shit! You should have brought a blanket. There's no shortage of wood to burn around here. Oh damn! You better get on it then. Thank you. People can freeze now. 
I didn't do that. What? Why did that just happen? A token for the new warden of the north. Let me guess. Forrester Iron. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Man, oh shit. Iron wood. Doesn't look like much. Uh. Don't know what's so special about it. No one can match our skill. Is that so? Yeah, try it out. <gasps> See? Not bad. Lord I mean, I could probably do better than you, but you know. Lot do this? Given enough time, we could learn. Given enough time, you could do a great many things. But not this, apparently. Ha. You suck. Even he sees it. Wait, why am I fucking looking down on that? Like, oh, I feel so bad for him. <laughs> what am I gonna do? I don't know. Quite the army you have, Lord Forrester. Very impressive. Well, so much for intimidating him. We didn't really have guys stationed at the front now, did we? Brilliant. Fucking brilliant. Oh, and there's that fucking open balcony there. It's really easy to fucking shoot someone from. Or shoot someone at. Hey, we were just outside. How's it going? Look at that. More Forrester. Lord Ramsay? Yeah, it's not just Come me. Out where I can see you. We really must focus on the business of He likes staring at people, it's okay. What is it you want, Lord Ramsay? What do I want? Everything. Nothing. We'll see. First. Dang, that's very contradictory. Let's see you bend the knee to my father. Lord Falcon. Warden of the North. Uh... Words are wind. Anyone can say they're loyal. I only kneel to yeah, the that's king. not happening. Is not the no, I don't even do that. Don't respect. fucking speak for me there, game. But then, I am not my father. Perhaps that is what you meant to say. You see? Nope, I just don't You're care. Traitor, just like his father and brother. Here's the thing. I don't care about your loyalty. See? Why are you getting angry about Brown, it? However, oh, come on, what you've got. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries. Ships, shields... Chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. Pots? You want pots? My father has promised as much to the king. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. We will double our efforts for your father, my lord. That's a good little lord. You can't trust a forester. They murdered our men. Hey, that's a it generalization. Was the squire who did it. One White Hill soldier dead. One bolt. Yet your man. You're mistaken. Lives. No, you're mistaken. That's not how it happened. Our men are dead. How it happened is irrelevant. You had me stand out in the wind and muck so you could show off your pathetic little army. Yeah, so much good that did. I didn't really that's show it off very well, from did one I? Of our loyal banana so I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. Really? Cool. The White Hills will be taking control of your Ironwood from this day forth. What? That sounds terrible. The Ironwood. But that is our livelihood. Then How does that benefit us? Well find another fucking job. You can't do that. Oh dear. Why not? You know something the White Hills don't? Uh, how to we make Ironwood. Talking about trees. Good. You grow them. Cut them down. The White Hills had ironwood once, but now those hills are bare. Hence the name, of course. They know nothing of how to cultivate the forest. Look yeah, don't you understand that? Sigil, my lord, a barren hill. Hey, Do you, you want silly. ironwood for the next five years or the next fifty generations? The little lord does have a point. Oh, we'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half. Of your iron wood, 
And we'll see who thinks but we already know who fares Come better. On. Half of something is better than the nothing you had before. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a Why does he star. want it? Like, he, doesn't he know he's gonna Twenty suck dick? At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ethan. They'll help yeah, maintain the that? king's peace. And make sure there's we'll no bar the gates. trouble. We'll bar the gates! <laughs> Too late for that. Why did they just let him in? Like, nobody does anything I want. I'm the lord here. You just have to listen to me. No one listens to me. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. Griff will lead the garrison. You have no right. White Hills have no place here, lads. Where's Sword Royal and he should probably be here. Please, Duncan, don't. Fight him to the death. We can do it. Look at this little forester. You're not frightened. Are you? Lord Ramsay, oh. please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? I'm his twin, my lord. Ah. Oh, oh shit. Well, like the queen and her brother. Well, <laughs> hopefully not just like the queen and her brother. No, we haven't gone to that phase yet. I'm, I'm working on it, though. I never had a sister. Oh. Nope. Always wanted one. Leave my sister alone! Yeah, she's mine. You'll come with me. You can be my highborn ward. Lord <gasps> Ramsay, that's enough. Oh shit. Wait, do I really you just like have him? fucking Duncan here as my fucking Let her go. swordsman? She's quite pretty, your sister. <laughs> this is fucking terrible. I suppose you can stay. Cool, thanks. Glad we all got that worked out. Bold. Yeah, so uh, now that everything's cool. Oh, all right. What have you done? Well, but I don't want a fall, no. Cause you're a pussy. Far too much trouble. You're a pussy. You don't want to deal with how cool and awesome I am. I nearly bent me eventually. Oh shit! I think we Aren't you a witty one? I certainly feel better about all this. He's what have you done? Yeah, However, I'd say I do too. The foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. I mean, I get to have, feel the whole new experience of Take blood going down my throat. It's kind of interesting. Lovely meeting all of you. Oh yeah, do that little twirl. Oh. Whatever the fuck that was. Maester, quickly! Maester, Maester. Mother! Let him take me! Let it go! Don't worry, I'll stop them. I'll open my mouth. I can do it. Look, I'm doing it. I'm opening my mouth. See? Oh. I made a sound. I made a sound, though. I made a sound. That's progress. I might not be dead yet. You can't say I'm dead. You can't say I'm dead. All I did, maybe I just fainted. Maybe I just fainted. You don't know. Your story has begun. <laughs> oh. See, Ethan I'm not dead. sacrificed himself for us all. Okay, he I'm saved dead. Talia's life. He'll be remembered as I don't Ethan think she was gonna brain. die. This well, house maybe. needs a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. My sister so. asked you to swear loyalty to her son, and you flat out refused. We can't Why do you sound like you give a shit? Too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. And they're all like 200 miles away in totally different directions. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again, our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes so without a cost, are. lady. Are you prepared for what might happen? I'm gonna kill everyone with that knife, see? Told you I can just stab anyone in a moment's notice. All right, you and 37.6% swore loyalty to Marjorie. Yeah, well, fuck Cersei. Uh, you and 48.6% freed Eric. Yeah, well, um, don't quite give a shit. Uh, it's actually interesting to me, um, how many people are merciful in this? I, I kind of figure, like, uh, you know, because this is actually the majority choice here, if you think about it, because there's three choices there. 
and this is 48.6, so that's almost half. So, like almost half of the people for three different choices. So, yeah, that's the majority. And, um, unless, like, literally no one picked one of them, which is, no, but, um, but yeah, so it's, it's kind of interesting, because, I mean, I just figure, like, a lot of people in these playthroughs are quite aggressive, <laughs> uh, you know, not as many as I, uh, not as many as you might think, um, which is interesting, uh, you and 69.1% picked Duncan as Sentinel, well, I already picked Royland before, it's sort of an interesting mix and match, and, you know, I want to see the other side now, so, yeah, even though it might not mean much, I don't know, uh, human 49.9% met Ramsey at the gate, well, I didn't want to appear like a bitch, so there you go, look at that sexy face, um, oh yeah, there you go, there's episode one, again, so yeah, um, I might try recovering the file, um, that I lost, if I don't get it, then you'll, you hearing this will probably mean that, <laughs> uh, but if I do, then you'll never hear this, so I guess it's kind of pointless for me to say, but, hey, yeah, um, because I, I do kind of like my first little, um, poke at this, you know, I always feel like the first time is the best, because it's like, it's all fresh, it all just comes out of you. Just like that, and with this, I kind of have to manufacture it a bit, because I kind of want to say a lot of the same things I said before, or I'll just think the same things that I said before, but then I'll, I'll, I'll realize, like, oh yeah, I have to say all of this again, and make it just as, you know, invoking as before, and, you know, that can be kind of hard to do when you have that pressure of matching up to just how you... in. It's how you re res instinctually responded the first time, sort of. So, yeah. It can definitely be a bit tasking. And it's annoying that I fucking lost the file, but... Whatever. Uh, how it goes sometimes with this fucking... Kind of shindig. You're dealing with fucking technical shit. And computer files and whatnot. But, yeah. Um, so, episode one's done. Um... I already got episode two recorded, so you'll definitely be seeing that shortly, and uh, stay tuned for more. See you again soon. Uh, actually, I thought there was sound that comes to this. I guess there isn't. Oh, you know what it is? Last time I actually made it to just by to just the end, I think, and it just all worked out perfectly. But see, it still ended up doing that because I kept talking. Cause you know, but yeah. I was going to end it a little bit abruptly there, but I'm going to actually end it here, like I did before, at the exit game screen. So, stay tuned for more, folks. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.